Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And the other question for Windows 10 comes with Microsoft Edge. So some people are using Edge, um, even though it's a small minority, it is still, um, you know, there for some to use. And some people like it, but of course, there's all the changes that's coming. I personally think that Microsoft Edge is going in the wrong direction with way too many things that are being added when it could have been a fantastic, simple browser. But um, a question that came to me for Windows 10 also, according to, um, you know, from Microsoft Edge browser itself, one of the questions that came through is, um, are versions of Edge for Windows 10 and Windows 11 the same? And they're pretty much the same, yes. Um, if you look at the, the, the build numbers, first of all, if you go into the um, help and feedback and the version numbers, you'll see that they follow the same version numbers uh, in general. So what this means is that basically they're this, it's the same thing. And um, the question came because uh, one of the impressions is, well, if Windows 10 is not, um, you know, having any new features, I'm afraid that Microsoft Edge will also not have anything new. Well, it will because everything that um, is happening in Edge is independent. It's an app that runs both in Windows 10 and 11. Although there could technically be a difference eventually, I don't think it will be. I think it will have in every feature you'll see in Windows uh, 11 on Microsoft Edge, you'll come to Windows 10 on Microsoft Edge also. It's like, you know, simply an app running in Windows. So as long as it's supported and running in Windows 10, it will have the features. And by the way, you know, one of the things that, that shows this is that the famous uh, Bing AI chat bot and so on everything and the Bing button on the upper right Everything is still there So it shows you that every single new feature they want to introduce uh, Will be in edge on Windows 10 also and um, I don't think they'll make much difference uh, the only thing that I could see happening is they might stop at a specific version eventually you know, maybe a year or a year or two before they might be saying, oh, well, this is the last version of Edge for uh, Windows 10. We'll support that version of Edge until the end of support of Windows 10. And the newer versions will be Windows 11 only. It's not impossible that could happen, but I don't see it happening for now. I think they're going to continue, uh, especially with Windows 10 being such high market share. Um, anything new that will happen in Edge in Windows 11 will be in Windows 10 also. So there's that's one side that will obviously be updated uh, regularly uh, and still be updated in the future. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.